Lemuel Smith, 42 years old, serving three life terms for rape, kidnap, and murder, is one of the few men alive to face death in the electric chair. The sentence is automatic. It comes with his conviction for the murder of Greenhaven guard Donna Payant in May of 1981. He allegedly confessed to a fellow inmate that he deserved to die. The sexual mutilation matched his pattern of killing. Do you deserve to die? Do I deserve to die? Not according to my standards. Others feel differently. How does it feel knowing you're now condemned to die and you're forced to look death in the face? I've looked death in the face ever since I was born black. You're not saying that everything that's happened to you in your life has happened because you're black. It's had something to do with it. As is his legal right, Lemuel Smith did not take the stand during the trial. If he had, the prosecution would have had the right to cross-examine him. But now that he's been found guilty, he's elected to go to the press to profess his innocence. Do you know who did kill her? I know I did. That's what's important. But do you know who did? And if you do, why aren't you saying to get yourself off? Would it get me off? But why wouldn't you tell if you knew? Who wouldn't want to believe that I didn't kill her? Smith hinted Payant was not killed inside the prison. He says she was set up by corrections officers who were trying to blackmail her with photographs they'd taken of her in compromising sexual situations. It was their way of getting her into the prison drug ring. Her guard jacket was never found. Her body was found in the prison no, so dump. If she was killed by corrections officers, was she involved with drugs, do you believe? Was that part of it? Was, her was sexual... she being blackmailed? I don't know. Had photographs been taken of her that you know of involved sexually? Did the state police confiscate them? Where are they? Did the state police confiscate them? And they disappeared? As he said on the day of the verdict, he goes to his fate in peace. Do you think you'll die in the electric chair or by injection or some other state-imposed means? Who knows? God knows the future. I don't. Are you scared about that? No. Should I be? Should I be afraid? I mean, that would be a good, a good, better story if I was afraid, but why would I be afraid? I haven't done anything. Like I said, I got peace. 